Hey there, Stephen Pegg from Loves to Travel. Thanks for checking out our videos. Always appreciate when you watch our videos. Heading up to Sam's Club on a weeknight again. Normally we used to come up here on weekends, but I'm finding that there's less people than on the weeknights than there are on the weekdays, don't you think, honey? Yes, that is correct, sweetheart. So we're gonna check it out tonight. Uh, before we get up there, if you have not hit the uh, subscribe button below, love for you to do that now. Also the bell notification button below, that'll get you notified when we put up future videos. And please hit the like button too, because that does help us out immensely. Gonna check out the deals at Sam's Club. I do wanna mention, by the way, I saw one of the comments in our video a couple, three videos ago that people thought that we were retired. Uh, no, you're not retired. You still work your 40. I'm semi-retired, so I still have a lot of time to myself. But uh, we're not fully retired yet. Just I'm semi-retired and you're working full-time, right? Yes, one day I wish. <laughs> Hopefully in the near future, uh, we'll get retired and be able to do uh, what we want to do every day. But right now we're just, I'm semi-retired and you're not where you're working full time. So let's get parked. We're going to head on into Sam's Club and we'll check out some deals. So hang tight. Oh yeah, Mother's Day's coming up, sweetie. How about a margarita gift set, $39.98 with a cocktail, they spelled cocktail wrong, cocktail shaker, uh, a charcuterie gift set for $39.98. The Modern Gourmet Hot Sauce Trunk, 15 flavors for $24.98. I don't know if that's a Mother's Day gift or No, but you remember when our kids did the uh, hot sauce challenge with wings? Oh, yes. Oh, my gosh. And then they just got some regular stuff here for summer. The barbecue grilling gift set with cutting board. The campfire gift set. And here's what I would get. The Hershey's S'mores kit. Actually, that's not a bad price, actually. How many candy bars do you get with that? It says... Makes 18 s'mores. I guess it has nine. Nine full size nine full size candy bar is going to cost you nine bucks anyway. Bag of mar. I'm getting this. No, we're not. We have chocolate. I found a bag of chocolate. Oh, you did find a bag of chocolate. Yes. Okay. Of course, you found chocolate. We got a bunch of charcoal stuff. Oh, that's a gas grill. $3.99 for the gas grill, 5B Pro Series. It's a griddle, actually. Oh, it's a griddle. Yeah, it's a griddle. Yeah. Wow. It's not a grill, it's a griddle. It's a griddle. Then your pool stuff. That's here now. It's a little early for pool, but there are plants. Yeah. We're supposed to go to 75 this weekend. They've got bird feeders here at uh, Sam's Club, $32.98 for a premium bird feeder. Um, you know, that'd be kind of cool in our backyard. I just would have a hard time remembering to fill it. Well, you heard that there was a bird feed, a, a bird sea shortage. Oh, yeah, well, there's a bird flu going on right now, too. Is so. it? But there was a bird sea shortage because some of the elements comes from overseas also, in Russia. So you're talking about uh, supply chain issues because of the war now. Yes. This is a cookie bite break apart. Four gifts in one. Uh, two assorted styles. Now, $22.98 is what it's going to cost you. And that's what one of them looks like. And there's another style, too, right next to it. So there's two styles that you can get. So this is like a thank you on mm -hmm. the left one. And this is another thank you. But this could be um, a Mother's Day one mm -hmm. on the right side. And it comes with cookies. Right. Salted. Well, let's see. They got salted caramel cookies, chocolate chip cookies, more salted caramel chocolate chips. Let's see if they got the same thing on this one. Yep. Yeah, salted caramel and chocolate chip cookies uh, are inside the box. So these are actually pretty cool because it says, thanks for everything you do. You're the best. You make the world a nicer place. And thanks for making a difference. You know what I would do with these after you get the cookies gone? This is a great thing to put your, uh, your change out of your pocket change in. Mm -hmm. And keep your pocket change. We are on a hunt for coffee. Well, a certain kind of coffee, actually. I also want to see if they have any uh, Rice Krispies. Because there's been a Rice Krispies. I should have bought Rice Krispies when I had a chance, by the way. Well, you did not want to buy it. But you said you need Cheerios? No, I don't need Cheerios. I need Rice Krispies. I'm out of what? Rice Krispies and I'm out of Wheaties. Oh. Those are the two I'm out of. Nope, they don't have them here. We're on search for the Starbucks bottles. And I think, well, they might be in the next aisle, honey. They're certainly not here. Yeah, I don't see them here. 
That is one of Andy's things that he put on this list. Let's check around the corner and see if they're around the, around the corner here. I'm kind of looking through the aisle too, honey. Yeah. To see if they're on the next aisle over. Yeah. Like I said, we have not been able to find them. We cannot find them at... Um, they're not at Costco, I know that. Nope. Could it be the next aisle over? Yeah. Soda's cheaper here than it is at Costco, by the way. Is it? Yeah, by about 30 cents. Really? Yeah. So, and Pepsi's, well, uh, That's the third. these are the 30 packs. That's the minis. But I think it's uh, $12.98 at uh, Costco, and it's $12.68 here. So, for Coke products, anyway. But do you know what they don't have here? What? The limit signs are gone. Yeah. They, well, I don't think they had limit signs here. The limit signs were over at uh, Costco. No, they had limit five. Oh, limit five here. You're right. They did. Let's see if they're down this aisle. Doesn't look very promising, honey. No, you're right. It doesn't really. We found it once. They had like a pallet full. But you know, they come in and out. Oh, there it is. We found it. Oh, yeah. Oh, God. Right there. Starbucks Frappuccino. Yep. There it is. Did you want to get one or two just in case? Uh, one. Just one? He is not supposed to have these that often. Yeah, he does pay us back for these, by the way. So it's not like he's we're buying them for him. Yeah, these are $1.34 each. But remember, these are still cheaper than going to Starbucks. Yeah, it is. And it's still cheaper than having to buy the uh, Arnold Palmer for the other boy. Oh, this is something different. Ice latte from Black Stag. Vanilla latte. Well, that's something different. I've not seen that yet. They also have the espresso with cream, the Black oh, Stag espresso yeah. with cream. That's something different. I've not seen that either. I'm not a fan of lattes or espressos, but I, I, I do like the Frappuccinos. Oh, but they also have another one, Java Variety, the Monster. Oh, those are Monsters? Yes. So basically... Yeah, those, are, those are from Monster. So these are coffee. All of the coffee drinks are expanding here. Mm -hmm. Everybody's into specialty foo-foo coffees. Are you into specialty coffees or do you just like regular coffee? Me, I just like regular coffee. I know that a lot of people, though, that I work with are into, they're, they're actually thinking about getting an espresso machine in the in where I work um, because a lot of people like the uh, specialty coffees. They want to get an espresso machine. It's really weird, honey. Oh, jelly? Yeah, because we can find us at Costco. And Kroger was actually out of jelly, too. They were? Yeah, Kroger was out of jelly when we went there last week. Uh, the Welch's Concord Grape Jelly 448 for two of these 30-ounce jars. This is a great deal, by the way. Unless you can get it like on sale for uh, cheap at Kroger when it goes right. on sale. But I'm going to grab this. Did you happen to check the dates? Yeah, you? I was going to look at the dates. Uh, again, oh. I can't read. Oh, did you get your new glasses? Yes, I did, but they're in the car. Oh, well, that doesn't help me in here. I don't see a date on these. Let me check. What is this? Phenomenal? Ooh. Ooh. We will have to try this. Well, Andy will have to try this. This is something the kids would like. Yeah, we haven't been able to find ramen, uh, actually. So this, this is a gluten-free, MSG-free, dairy-free, soy-free, made with non-GMO ingredients. Authentic Vietnamese noodle soup with real pho ingredients. Oh, no, it's, I'm sorry, it's pronounced pho. 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 So we have to try this. Yes, I'm getting this so that Andy can try it, see if he likes it. Phenomenal beef pho. It's a little expensive, but he likes to try things. How many How many you get in there? Six. Six, so it's about a buck and a quarter a piece. About. Yeah, thereabouts. Yeah, the, the one thing we noticed that we there is such a lack of ramen. Mm -hmm. And someone did mention this a while back, that there was going to be a lack of ramen, and guess what? There is. So our kids are having issues. Ramen withdraw. Yeah, exactly. They do have the... Uh, Ramen cups here, the uh, cup of noodles, but that's not really ramen. That is, uh, that's instant cups. Yes, yeah, the instant cup of noodles. They had a really, really good ramen here for a while. And number two son wanted us to buy a pallet of it because he liked it so much. I was going to buy him more and we came up here and they were already gone. Let's see if there's anything down here. Right, we were wrong and incorrect. The sale is officially. Over. Mm -hmm. 
So there's nothing on sale right now other than online specials. Right. So there may be some clearance items. And we did actually have to pick up a few things. We were out of certain things, so we'll just have to buy them at normal price, which yeah. I hate. Which we hate. But it's still cheaper here than buying them at the local Kroger. Well, depending on what you're buying too, because this, buying two of these, because the date on it, you check the date on it, it's like 2023, 20, right? Right. Um, so that's actually really cheaper than buying it at the uh, at the store, unless it's really, really on sale. So we're on a hunt for cream cheese. Yeah, and they have it here. We just have to find out where it is. It's one of the uh, refrigerated aisles. We got it here last time. And it was a two pack. Yeah. And I said at the time, I didn't think you were gonna go through it. Well, you guys did. It's gone. Yeah. So it should be right here. Unless they moved it into that center aisle, into the dairy location, yeah. which they sometimes do. And they may just have, because they have a new dairy location here. And I have the feeling that's what they did, because it's not here. So let's walk over to the dairy and see if it's in the dairy. And I think I see it right now, as a matter of fact. A double pack of cream cheese? Yeah, it's right as you walk in the door. Do you see it? Oh, I see it. It's going to get loud for a minute, so... There it is. So double pack. It's like 1078. That's high, but. But you guys are going to go through this, aren't you? Yes, we are. Anything else in here you want to get as long as we're freezing while we're no, in here? No, we're good. I want to see if they have chicken. The chicken prices went up, really? They're, well, I understand that, but the rotisserie chicken. Oh, they Do you remember it. last? No, they don't. I don't see it there. There, oh, there might be some there now. The last time we were here, we were going to get one, and they said they were temp temporarily unavailable. And then somebody said that there was a chicken shortage because of the bird flu. And Walmart had to get rid of all their chickens. So do they have it? Yes, they do. Yeah, they have some. They have some chicken. So that's and still you like good. you like this chicken better. Yeah, but look at that. They're pretty burnt. Uh, yeah. So I am picking up on my chicken. So I'm going to pass on the chicken. While we're here, let's get your um, apples? Fuji apples, yeah. Are you getting your turnovers? He loves his turnovers. Oh, these are so good. April 20, does that say April 23rd? Yes, it does. All right. He loves his turnovers. These are so good. Honey, I'm gonna let you go in and get mushrooms, okay? I'll wait out here. Oh, why? It's oh, warmer out here. Look at the flowers. Didn't expect that in here. I guess so. How much are these flowers? Twenty-nine ninety-eight. Oh, these are Easter centerpieces. So these are past due. I'm looking for mushrooms. Here we go. Whole white mushrooms for three forty. Fine, I'm coming in. There's mushrooms, honey. Cool. I gotta show you the sign that's out here. Are you gonna get another one? I don't know, the date was pretty dated bad on that one. Yep, I guess that's it. Okay. I wanna show you the sign that's out here. I, I never saw this before. Hold on, I thought we had to get broccoli too. Is there broccoli here? Oh, what are you looking for? Broccoli? That would be over here, I think. Broccoli florets, is that what you want? Yeah, that's fine. Just want a bag of it? Yes, please. It's a little, it's, yep. Okay. Not a bad price, three ninety eight for that. A lot cheaper than that three dollars a pound I oh paid my a gosh. couple months ago. How are we on romaine lettuce, by the way? Did we go we through it all yet? Don't have any. You see this sign out here? I've, I've never seen this before. What is it? I'm Ooh. actually glad they have it. I didn't know that. So keep your avocados out of the out of the fridge. I knew bananas didn't go. I didn't know about pineapple. Pineapple. Uh, Tomatoes should stay out of the cooler. Onions should stay out of the cooler. Oh, I did not know that. I've been bad because I've been putting avocados in the fridge. Yeah. I put garlic in the fridge. Yeah. I put my mangoes in the fridge. Mm -hmm. Oh, I put my tomatoes in the fridge. This is stuff that shouldn't be in the fridge. Wow. Interesting. I did not know that. I didn't know that either. So I saw that and I figured you'd be interested in seeing that. That was pretty cool. All right, let's go get apples.
God, my favorite apples are here. Fuji apples. I don't know why you got me into Fuji apples. I really don't. I was a big Red Delicious fan Ooh, for so they long. They went down in price. Oh, thank goodness. How much did they go down in price? I didn't realize. They were six sixty-eight. Something went up in price. They're six twenty-three. All right. Well, let's get one. Well, the sad thing it was cheaper in Las Vegas. Oh, yeah. About something. About time something went up in price. Those look okay. Yeah, they do. They look really good. Five okay. pounds. Dollar twenty-five a pound, and these are these are whopping big apples, so you know. Yeah, you got me into Fuji apples. I was a big fan of Red Delicious for so long, but you got me into Fujis. Anything else you want to look at while we're here? Let's see what else is interesting. Bread here. We're doing a two-pack of bread for three forty-eight sunbeam. The date on that? I can't read the date. Five five. Oh, that's good. I did get my new glasses. I just don't have them with me. Are those the right one? Are you sure I'm making sure no, these those are? No, these are my oh. normal glasses. I have to wear, I have prescription reading glasses. You know that. Okay. You know what we haven't made in a long, long oh, time? Oh, the pizza of non bread. Non bread. Then non -bread maybe we let's go take a look at that. We love this stuff. And we may do a pizza. That's actually a good idea for dinner tonight, by the way. The non-bread pizza? Non-bread pizza. Four ninety-eight. That's not bad at all. We make little pizzas on this. I think we have a video on it. Yeah, we have. Did we do a video on those already? Yeah, so we could link it here. Oh, the two packs. I wish they yeah, had. Yeah, but like, all they have is plain. Yeah, I know. So we solved our bread issue, mm -hmm. but of course that's because we moved. <laughs> yeah, our bread is, was turning up moldy and we figured out that it was the way we were keeping it. By the way, did we get the shark here or Costco? It was at Costco. Okay. So I wanted to clarify that because I was unsure of where we got it. We got it at Costco. So the one we got was basically a shark lift away with a pet. Is this the one we got? It was like the Pet Plus. It's very similar like this one. Very similar to that one. But one I think we pay like 160 something. And the one we had um, was very different because it had the special thing at the end where, oh, here it is. This is what we got. The. Is that one right no, there? No, had, we had the self cleaning brush yeah, roll that's what I thought. on that. This is the one right here. But that the was not cleaning brush roll. Yeah, but that's not it. Because ours is blue. Was yeah. it blue? I mean, it's it's close. Right. I mean, that's a dual clean. So ours is basically this one here. That's got a self cleaning brush roll right there. Right, but that's not the one. If you actually no. look at it, that's not the right one. Ours is actually this one, hmm. but with the end of that one. Yeah. Well, I do like it though. Well, that's, I like it because you were the one who was cleaning, not me. Yeah. I don't mind vacuuming. Don't get me wrong. I don't mind vacuuming at all. That doesn't bother me. The only thing that I really have a problem with is folding fitted sheets. Oh, I don't know how to do that I either. cannot fold fitted sheets to save my life. Speaking of fitted sheets, Disney doesn't do fitted sheets, do they? No, they don't. And uh, we had actually got a tour years ago of the laundry facilities at Disney their sheets are all the same size. The twins, the queens, the kings, top and bottom sheets are the same so that they can run them through the washing machine, run them through the dryer, run them through the press and an automatic folder and they can't use fitted sheets. And there's also no colors, everything is white. But they only have like queen and king. They don't have twin. Honey. Well, what do they do for the pull down beds? Those are twins. Oh yeah, you're right. Okay, you're right. I guess I was wrong there. You're right one time, I admit. <laughs> Uh, you know, I thought I was wrong once, but I was mistaken. You know, I might actually get this for you for Mother's Day this year. You, every time we walk by, you say, I want that, I want that. 20 bucks, a Sterling & Noble 30-inch farmhouse wall clock. What wall would we put it on? Oh, were you over the fireplace. 
That's actually not a bad idea. Over the brand new fireplace of the house. How's that's, that? That's not a bad idea. What do you guys actually. think? What do you guys uh, think? Should we get put that over the fireplace? This would be a good good thing to have. You might actually get it this year. It's only nineteen ninety eight. Now I did fight. I did buy you one year a full length mirror because you like the full length mirrors. Uh huh. But I sure as heck didn't pay eighty bucks for it. This one's eighty dollars seventy nine ninety eight for that full length mirror. Why I don't know. You can always buy me a sectional. No, I don't need a sectional. No, we don't need a sectional. We do need an area rug, though, in the new house, uh, in the living room area. Oh, we do. Yeah. So we have to take a look at these. I'll look yeah. at all the different choices. Yeah. Yeah, we do need an area rug, so I might look at an area rug. It's not a bad price either. Um, 100, 100 bucks to 200 bucks, depending on the rug. That's high, honey. That's the Martha Stewart rug. Yeah, it all depends on the rug. Yep. Lots of rugs here. Some are ninety nine ninety nine. Yeah. And some are one seventy nine ninety nine. Those are yeah the seventy. They have seventy nine dollar ones, seventy nine ninety nine ones here. But I don't think there's any piles on them. Look at yeah. that. I just don't want to get an ugly one. That's that's all. like Berber. I hate Berber. Yeah, that's like Berber. This one has like cutouts. Yeah. I'm more of a um, plush person. Yeah, we'll have to look for an airy rug, because we do need an airy rug in the new house. I think this is more of the plush right here. The Martha Stewart one? The Martha one? Stewart is more of the plush, but it has some cuts in it, too. But yeah, this but that, is... This that is would good. actually fit better where we need it, too. Though. Yeah, and this is better pile. Huh. But what's the price of this one? Does it say? This one has good pile right here. Oh, yeah, you're right. Well, that has good pile. 8 by 10. Yeah, I think this one's... Uh, is this the Mohawk? That's Kerastan. It doesn't say. Um, the Bahama the Bahama ones, the Bahama ones are 100 bucks. Right. So the Mohawk Home Caspian is 199 but I don't see which ones those would be in here. Well, we have to keep checking it yeah. out. Yeah. So as we wrap things up here at Sam's Club, again, the sale, the monthly sale is over with, so there's not really a lot of sale items that we were looking at, and we knew that. We just had to pick up some stuff, and we did. And then a couple of other things like phenomenal, faux nominal, because remember it's pronounced pho, not pho. So pho nominal bowl, which is a Vietnamese, uh, authentic Vietnamese noodle soup with real pho ingredients. And Andy loves pho. So we're going to let him try this and see if he actually likes it. Works out to what? About a buck and a quarter a bowl, right, honeys? Well, it's six bowls and it was almost like nine dollars, so it was a little bit more than that. Okay, well, I thought there was eight. It was, it was like only my, six. Yeah, it's like dollar fifty a bowl. Okay, so we're gonna try and see if we like it. We picked up some other things too. We got our grape jelly finally, um, and there's some other things that we needed, but they didn't have it. So we're gonna head over to Kroger and see if they've got anything at Kroger that we need too. So thanks for watching this video. We always appreciate when you check out our uh, Sam's Club videos. If you've not hit the subscribe button below, please do so. Also, that bell notification button below because that'll get you notified when we put up future videos. Please hit the like button too. That helps us out immensely. Thanks for watching. Appreciate you checking it out and have yourself a magical day.